Hey everybody, it's John here again, and today I picked up another one of the Marvel Legends Hulkbuster Build-A-Figure figures. Um, this time it's uh, Valkyrie, and she comes with the right arm to build the Hulkbuster. She is in the standard and current Marvel Legends um, style packaging where you can clearly see the figure and the Marvel logo. And on the side here is some artwork with the figure of Valkyrie. And the other side has the companion that shares this box, Thundra. Um, on the back is a look at the two figures that share this package. Um, the figures that it take to build the Hulkbuster. And a very small blurb which says, With the unbreakable dragon fang sword, and a heavy steel chain, these heroines bring evil to its knees. Again, there's her name, Marvel's Valkyrie, which is nice that they put that on there. That's pretty much all there is to the package. Um, if you give me a second here, I'll open it up and take a closer look. Alright, here we have uh, Valkyrie outside of her package. As you can see, she stands fairly well on her own which is always a plus with the female Marvel Legends characters. Um, just by quickly looking at her, she does have very minimal uh, paint deco to her. She just is in a solid black outfit, painted bands on her arms, silver paint on her, on her uh, biceps, painted and, uh, wristbands, and a little bit of detail paint in her hair. And her face isn't too horrible. And she just has this belt that goes around her back. This, she, this one seems to have melted a little bit on her rear back side here, which is unfortunate. Uh, here is, let me get a, a, up close of her face. Not too bad. The hair is really nice. Uh, Valkyrie debuted in 1970 in the Avengers and quickly went on to join the Defenders with um, other heroes such as Doctor Strange, the Hulk, um, Hellcat, Son of Satan, and a few others that came up periodically. She did have a, I believe it was a Pegasus she rode. Um, her hair is very nicely uh, sculpted on here. So there's this weird line that cuts through her head. And she has some odd paint smudges. And... Other than that, the part in the hair is pretty nice. Let's see what her articulation is like. Well, her hair does not hinder her head. It does go all the way around. It doesn't really go up or down at all. She does have shoulders that shoot little pieces of plastic out. They go up and down and all the way around. She does have a bicep swivel. Her elbows do bend pretty well. And she has a wrist swivel, as well as a really, really tight hinge. There it goes. Now, being a female, she doesn't have the cr ab crunch, but she does have a kind of diaphragm swivel, which turns very nicely, and nothing at her waist. She does have some decent hip movement there. Here, ladies, go. F I go forward about that much, and <clears throat> not back at all. Oh, that's weird. What the? There you go. She, her joints are a little weird. As you can see, she has an upper bicep swivel, double jointed knees. And she does have an ankle that goes forward and back and has very crazy rockers on them. It's a sign of the Marvel Legends there. Let me 
Let's see if I can get her standing again. I'm coming. Now that I've twisted her joints all around. There she goes. And she does come with her dragon fang sword here. It does have it doesn't have a dragon head on it. Looks like it has um, almost a phoenix. Maybe a well, some kind of bird. Maybe a griffin head. And that does fit into her hand. Maybe. Come on. That head makes it a little bit more difficult. There it goes. There she is, armed. And as I said, she also comes with the Hulkbuster's right arm. Has this kind of gold paint with this little bit of a marbling effect in it, which is kind of neat. Might just have a little paint smudge right there. The detail in the hand is pretty neat. A little bit of silver peeking through here and here. A little bit of marbling in the red, which is nice when the light picks it up. I don't know if you can see it on the camera or not. here see how much larger scale he is and it is just on this little tiny peg which should pop right into here and now he has his arm oh pop back out again I don't think it caught all the way try one more time put a little bit of force into there it just keeps on not wanting to click in well let's see if I can put a little bit more effort into it after we get done here anyway that is Valkyrie from the Marvel Legends Hulkbuster build a figure wave uh, there's still tons of these guys sitting on my shelves at Walmart I mean we just finally got the uh, giant man build a figure wave and just came in and it's September now and I'm still waiting for my X-Men figures to ship so hopefully one of these days they'll show up and I'll get this guy finished and we can move on to another one but anyway if you enjoyed this at all, hit that like or the thumbs up button and subscribe for more videos. Uh, be sure to check out my channel. And uh, as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you around.